Hey, Kurt here with EarthInCanada.ca and in this video we're going to show the Earth Straps. These, uh, these come to us from uh, Australia from a company called Earthling 3.0. Uh, they're a great way to ground your outdoor shoes, whether you're going for a run, walk, or golfing, or any other outdoor activity. So, let's give these guys a go. Okay, so, the, um, the Earth Straps. These are, these are them. They have an uh, extremely conduct or a sticky um, backing so just when you peel that off just be be careful with that we're gonna throw it on the shoe it doesn't matter whether you put it on the inside outside um, or even along the back but you do want to avoid any area that's really worn down so for the, this particular shoe we're gonna go on the inside um, just on the inside corner here and um, it's a, still an area that makes contact with the ground so it still works so the first thing to do is just give it a little wipe down just to clean it make sure that it adheres properly so we're just gonna just all on the outside and then there is inside the packaging it comes with a little uh, a little wipe to uh, to wipe down the shoe as well so just really clean that area make sure we get a good stick Okay, so you want the, uh, the short area to go on the bottom. Long area is gonna go inside the shoe. So I'm just gonna do a little quick little dry run of it. So that's gonna come up and then into the shoe. So here we go. So you want to hold it for, you know, a good little amount of time, maybe a, a 30 seconds to a minute or two, just to really make sure that it gets a good stick. So just hold that. And then run it up along the shoe. Don't leave any gaps or try not to leave any gaps. Just make sure that it's firmly against the shoe. down on the inside and there's just one little last piece to take off once you're almost at the end all right and that's it there it is all right, let's give these a test. All right, so we got this shoe, we, uh, we put the strap on. This shoe does not have any strap on, so it's not grounded at the moment. And uh, so what we're gonna do is we have the continuity tester. And what this does is, is basically it just shows continuity from the ground uh, through to the body. So um, we're gonna ground the, the continuity tester. And then uh, just by plugging this, plugging this directly into the earth, that's fine. And then uh, currently, if I lift that shoe up, I am not grounded. As soon as I put that shoe down, I'm grounded. Okay, not grounded, grounded. All right, so a couple points that I wanted to just point out. Um, I have my golf shoe here, and if you can see it, it's, it's a spikeless golf shoe, but you see where I, can, I put the strap, and I put it right in the arch, and the reason being, is A, it's gonna last a little bit longer, but B, main, most importantly, is because I'm 99% uh, of the time when you're on a golf course, then you're walking on grass. So the grass, you'll be able to, um, it'll make contact. So yes, if you are not, if you're on uh, concrete, this will not ground you. Um, but if you're gonna be doing outdoor sports or running in grass and whatnot, you can put it in a little bit of a, in a uh, depression in the shoe so that it'll last a lot longer and the, the strap won't get, um, won't get, worn out as fast so from the manufacturer uh, they say roughly three to six months uh, give or take depending on the wear of the shoe how you're using it 
Uh, that's the kind of the time frame for the lifespan. Another point to make is that you want to, if you're going to be wearing really thick socks, it's going to take a long time to, to make that con connection between the strap and the bottom of your foot. So what we recommend is kind of the thin ankle socks or just any thin sock and then that uh, the continuity will uh, or the connection will be made a little bit quicker. You give it about 10, 20 minutes for your, uh, for your foot to perspire to get enough moisture to make that contact and make things work. Hopefully that helps. If you have any questions, comments, give us a call or send us an email. Thank you.